Connect Tax Cycle and Zero to import data from Zero into T1, T2, and T5013 returns. To prepare for the import, you must first map the accounts in Zero to the codes used on the related forms. To do this, go to the chart of accounts in Zero and click on Export Giphy Codes. Mapping allows you to pair one or more accounts in Zero to the standard list of codes used in fields on forms in Tax Cycle. Choose the appropriate form from the list at the top right of the Tax Mapper screen. You can map accounts to codes on the General Index of Financial Information forms, commonly known as Giphy statements, in T2 and T5013 returns. In T1 returns, you can map accounts to the T776 Statement of Real Estate Rentals or the T2125 Statement of Business and Professional Activities. In the left-hand column, search for an account in Zero, or use the filters to show any unmapped accounts. Select the account you wish to map, then in the right-hand column, search for the applicable field on the form. Click the Map button to make the link. Repeat this process until all accounts are mapped. Then quickly review the mappings before going into Tax Cycle. Over in Tax Cycle, open a return and go to the related form. In Tax Cycle T1, go to the T2125 or the T776 form. In Tax Cycle T2 or T5013, go to any Giphy statement. The form you choose must match the form used to map the accounts in zero. Next, go to the Data menu and click on Import Zero Giphy Data. Enter your username and password and complete any multi-factor authentication that you have configured. The first time you connect, Zero will ask your permission for Tax Cycle to access data in Zero organizations. Select the organization you need access to and click Allow Access. Once you see a message in your browser window confirming that Tax Cycle has successfully connected to Zero, you can return to Tax Cycle. Tax Cycle attempts to match the Zero organization with details already on the related form. If it cannot find a match, you can search for the organization by name or select the organization in the list. If required, you can change the accounting basis to either accrual or cash. The default for this dialog box is set in Tax Cycle Options. However, whatever you choose here must also match what is set in the Zero Tax Mapper for the organization. When you're ready, click Import Giphy Data. Back on the form in Tax Cycle, you will see amounts and information from the Zero organization. A message at the top of the form shows you the date and time of the last import and provides a handy link to return back into the Zero Tax Mapper in case you want to adjust those mappings and re-import. Streamline your year-end write-ups for small business clients by connecting Tax Cycle and Zero.